Mumbai's dance bars have been banned since 2005. Last week the Supreme Court passed an interim order staying the ban. This is an admirable decision given the fact that the ban has had a huge socio-economic fallout. Shown of their main draw, dancing girls in their zari clad lehengas, thousands of beer bars shut down. More catastrophically, many of the jobless dance girls were forced into prostitution or were trafficked. Chief Minister Devendra Fadnavis has already declared that his government is determined to keep dance bars out of business. This is wrong headed in the extreme. You may or may not approve of dancing girls, but the state cannot outlaw a legitimate commercial activity simply on moral grounds. Whether it is liquor or dance bars, banning a product only drives it underground and makes its ecosystem far more unrestrained and dangerous. The Supreme Court ruling is an enlightened one. Though it did insert the caveat that the dancing should not be obscene, it is high time Maharashtra woke up to the fact that dance bars provided employment to thousands of women. The state has no moral right to stand in their way.